All right, boys and girls, what I have here is uh, my uh, big. Three fifty-seven seventies running in, in this system here, as you can see here. This one's kind of in a ghetto state. And when it comes to the way it looks like, I just have you know just you know, some twist ties and some zip ties holding the the uh, the hard drives there. Then two more hard drives there. This one over here, twenty-three fifty-seven seventies. Um, this is running the 8-core processor, the, uh, the bulldozer, the 8120. Um, so this is where I'm able to monitor everything for that system there. Each card is running about almost 200 mega hash. So, as you can see here, if I have focus, so... That is just one system. That is just one system there at the moment. Um, over here, I have a two sixty-nine seventies in this system here. So if you see here, I'm using some industrial type fans pushing the air in. On the very bottom here, I'm running just one video card on there because that system only has one full PCI Express slot. That one is running a 5830. So I'm going to be shutting that down or possibly put in a second card in there, but with a PCI 1 to PCI 16 times cable in it so I can actually fit that in that system there but this one over here is only running a dual core the top one which kind of get over there but uh, once I get my shelves I should be able to put all the boards and all the cards on that shelf which I'm gonna have on this side of the wall here which I'm gonna take everything down here and uh, just put uh, shelves there. There's going to be a five tier shelf with all the cards. It's going to be all plexiglass sealed inside and uh, pushing air in and having uh, a duct a duct tubing um, pushing the air outside of the house. It's going to be pushing out of there but uh, that's just AC that I keep everything cool in here which it does get very cold in here just to try to keep everything cool so I don't overheat the video cards. But um, here are some of the graphics cards that I have, which um, this one here is a 5830, which says, as I said, it was already in that one system. Here's another 6970, which is in that yellow system over there. I have another 6970 in there as well, but I don't have the box for that because I bought it OEM. Here's two 5770s, which are already which is actually in this system over here which only has one slot for PCI Express which I'm going to be taking out and putting into this board here which which is this one here so um, so this board right here supports See one, two, three, four, five full PCI Express slots, but um, I'm only going to be able to put four in there right now because I'm going to be waiting for the PCI Express ribbon cables. So I'll be able to put one here, one here, 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 and here. So I'm going to I'm going to have six cards in there, but I'm going to be putting two Dynex uh, 500 watts. I, I could definitely go and get a 1200 watt but um, if I run you know two Dynex which I could get for $27 each you know which it'll, it'll be just a little bit over 60 bucks if I go that way I'll be able to save a lot more so what I'm going to do is just um, it's just uh, what you want to call it uh, rig the other power supply to power the other two cards on the bottom here or three cards there so I'll be saving some money there 
So right here, I'm only running a dual core processor. And um, as you can see here, I'm gonna be using some Molex two six pin connectors to run uh, these 5770s, which I have here. I bought uh, six of them, but this was that other 5770. I was telling you that the boxes is over there. So as you can see here, this one here is a 5770, uh, the radio 770, and all of these, which is six of them, one, two, three, four, five, six, 5770s, Sapphire, and I got these, let me take it out here. I got these through a supplier at a very dirty price. I got these for for seventy three dollars tax included, and um, that's how I got um, the other three Sapphire seventy three dollars tax included that is running in this system, which I'm gonna be putting two more cards in here when I get the ribbon cables. So I'll have a total of five in that system there. So as you can see, um, it's running in this system right here. But uh, I'm running a 42 inch screen on this one here. So um, this one, at times I, I just game on it. So I just shut off one of the cards, which is the top card right here. I shut that off. You know, for money there, but uh, the other two cards are mining at the same time. Uh, so I shut the other card off while I just game, and uh, and when I stop gaming, I just turn it back on, and I'm on my way with mining. But I only game like a one or two hours at a time. That's about it. But um, back to the 5770s that I have here, which are six of them here and seven, which the one that doesn't match the other one. But the other one that's in that other blue case I'm showing you down over there actually is identical to this one here, which are those ones right there. But this one, this case, I mean, this motherboard here, I bought two of them. This is this one, and the other one is right over here, which is the one, this one is actually that one right there. I just took it out of the box. I managed to get this motherboard which was 289 last year this year i just checked about um, a few hours ago it's running at 189 at tiger direct but um i was able to get this motherboard with the processor through a private seller which is a dual core amd processor and three sockets i got them both with the motherboard and processor for 130 dollars no tax uh, no tax at all so over here I had the other one, which I just picked up today. I picked up both of these motherboards today and processors. The guy managed to leave, you know, the, the processors in them, you know, which is which is good. So just so I can just get them started right away. But um, I may have to just reapply thermal paste. You know, it's some aftermarket thermal paste if the temperatures are high. Over here, I got another power supply here. This is another 500 watt which I picked up for $27 and um, got a couple more power supplies over there, another LCD over there, but um, as you can see, it's mining, it's mining right now, um, once I get all of them running I'll probably be running at 3.3 um, 3 .3 giga hash, but um, I will eventually get to 50 giga hash, probably by September right now it's um, March 30th but um, I will be picking up some more some more video cards from the same supplier which he does have six more I couldn't pick them up because I had to pick up these boards right now but I'm um, at $73 a pop for each graphics card is uh, is a steal right now so but then um, if you get them anywhere around 100 bucks, you know, it's still good. But um, I managed to get them for $73 all taxing. The reason is because I am buying in bulk. Um, so what, what, I, what I was going to be doing in this one here is just um, installing 